A self-proclaimed skinhead from the Southland is accused of plotting to blow up a Colorado synagogue. And tonight, police tell us he once defiled a Thousand Oaks synagogue in a lewd way. CBS 2's Tom Wade is live in Thousand Oaks with new details about this man. Tom. Yeah, that's right, Pat. And we have some disturbing new images to show you as well. It turns out this guy was here in the Southland for a long time, spreading his vile hate. And this used to be a synagogue that he targeted. Police say these are partial screenshots from a video recorded by skinhead Richard Holzer that he shot of himself urinating on the front door of what was the Chabad of Thousand Oaks. The temple has since moved. Tonight we spoke with the temple's rabbi, who was stunned when he learned Holzer was the same man arrested in Colorado for plotting to bomb a synagogue there. It is very, very ironic and creepy. And, uh, Rabbi Chaim Brisky says a Ventura County detective alerted him last year about Holzer after the detective found the video on Holzer's social media. We've never smelled anything. We've never noticed anything. We only knew about it because the police told us this has happened. Detectives here were monitoring Holzer after they were alerted to hate speech he was posting online. Holzer moved away before Ventura County deputies could question him. Then came the news this week. Holzer was planning to blow up this synagogue in Pueblo, Colorado. The plan was to bomb it early Saturday morning. But undercover FBI agents foiled Holzer's murderous plan. Rabbi Brisky says it's chilling how his synagogue was once one of Holzer's targets. And that's really hit home. And uh, just so grateful that this is the opposite of all any tragedy. This is done right, caught before anything can happen. We asked the Ventura County Sheriff's Department if any other sites were targeted by Holzer. They say they do not have any evidence at this point that he did. Reporting live in Thousand Oaks, I'm Tom Waite, CBS 2 News.